Okay, my friends, good morning, everybody. Welcome. Good morning, Sebastian, Paolo, Rihanna. Good morning, Luciana. Who else is coming out? Oh, Valentina, Vanessa, good morning, Leonardo. Nadine, good morning. Christopher, good morning. Okay, my friends, let's start the class, okay? Good morning, teacher. My friends, this is the lesson number two. This lesson is what happened, okay? And we are going to start with this song. What's the matter, okay? Please open your microphones What's the matter? and let's sing, okay? It's easy, yeah? it's not so difficult. What's the matter? What's the matter? What's the matter? I am sick. What's the matter? Okay. Okay. I am sick today. Oh no. What's the matter? What's the matter? What's the matter? I am hot. What's the matter? Are you okay? I am today. Open your microphones, Lucia. Vanessa, Nina, I am cold. What's the matter? What's the matter? I am cold. What's the matter? What's the matter? What's the matter? What's the mother? What's the mother? What's the mother? I am sorry. What's the mother? 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 What is what's the matter? Who knows this question? Uh, not exactly because they say pasa? tired. Yes. Yeah. Teacher. Teacher. Tell me, Valentino. What is in Spanish? Teacher, puede ser. ¿Cómo cómo está el clima? Puede ser. How's the weather? ¿Cómo estás? Mm. Yes, teacher. Not exactly weather, huh? It's similar to how are you? Very similar to how are you? What's the matter? Fernanda, okay, you... yo le puedo decir. Tell me, Fernanda. Um, yo creo que es que pasa. Yes, that is the correct. In Spanish is that. ¿Qué pasa? ¿Qué pasó? What's the matter? Okay? You can say, no, I am hot, I am cold, I am tired, I am sad, I am bored. I am happy, you can say that. And why? Okay, let's see, let's practice this, okay? Let's see, Christopher Soto, what's the matter? Christopher, what's the matter? I am sick today. Oh, you're sick. Thank you, let's see. Abril Palomino, Abril, what's the matter? Abril. Where is Abril? Oh, it's not here. Fabricio, what's the matter? I am, um, I am cold. Okay, good. Thank you, my friend. And we have other question, no? This, why? Why means give me a reason. For example, if I say, what's the matter? I am happy. Why? Oh, because I am going to visit my granny tomorrow, teacher. That's why I am happy. Now you give me a reason, okay? One more time, please. Open your microphones. We are going to sing the song, okay? One more time, open your microphones. What's the matter? Paolo, Rihanna, Luciana, open, open your microphones. What's the matter? 
Today the teacher is going to evaluate in a conversation. We are going to work in groups and in a conversation you are going to use these expressions. Okay? You are going to speak in English and you are going to say, Hi Camila, what's the matter? I am called teacher. Why? And then you are going to give a reason. Okay? Try to use this expression in your conversation. Also, you need to use the vocabulary, okay? But if you are in silent in your group and you don't speak, you don't open your microphone, sorry for you. I'm going to put your seat, okay? And if you confuse the vocabulary, if you confuse the grammar, I'm going to give you this, okay? So let's start. Please open your student books, okay? You have your student books, this, we finish with this page, no? Let's go to the 30A and 39. Let's go. 30A and 39. Let's start with the vocabulary. Okay, this is our vocabulary. <clears throat> what page? As always, no? 30A. Please open your microphones, listen and repeat. Sleep. 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 Break. 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 Hero, 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 back, 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 Good. Vanessa, can you read the vocabulary? Break, fine, break, fine, curve, zero, back. Keep non spring. Repeat Vanessa. Break. Break. Fall. Fall. Good job, girl. Good. Valentina, it's your turn. Read the vocabulary, please. Lopez. Valentina. Oh, come on, Valentina, it's not in class. Lucia, please read the vocabulary. Sleep, sleep, breath, fall, hurt. Continue. Kitchen. Arrow. Arrow. Back. Hit. 
Nice. Spring. Spring. Good, Lucia. Good job. Okay, my friends, this is our vocabulary. Huh? This is a slip. Teacher, what is this in Spanish? You're walking and then you slip. No, that is resbalarse. Okay. Break, you know, no? Break is this. Fall, this action. Hurt, lastimarse, dañarse. Okay, hurt. Kitten, you know, this animal. Hero, superhero, no? A hero. Back, you know, the parts of the body. Hit is another action. Hit is this, when you hit someone. This action. Noise. No, you listen a noise. Oh, teacher, someone is talking. Noise. And then a sprain. Teacher, what is a sprain? A sprain is torcerse, dislocarse. Okay, and that is a sprain. But we are going to talk about in past tense, huh? no present. We are not going to use these actions. We are going to use this other word, in past. We are not going to use break. We are going to use the past. Not the present, the past. Okay, the past of this action. Please open your microphones one more time. Repeat. Sleep, sleep it. Sleep, sleep it. Sleep, sleep it. Sleep, sleep it. Break, broke. Break, break, bro. Fall, fell. Fall, fell. fell. Heart, heart. Heart, heart. Heart, heart. It. 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 Sprain, a sprain it. A sprain, a sprain it. Sprain it. Good. Okay, my friends. Now pay attention to the story. Okay, pay attention to the story. What happened in this story? What's the matter with Greg? No, what's the problem with Greg? He had an accident. But what happened? He broke. He slipped, he fell down, he hurt, he hit, he sprained it. Now, what happened? Watch the story, okay? Pay attention, and you are going to answer this question. What's the mother? What's the mother? But in this case, what's the mother with Greg? Okay? And then you are going to say why. What is the reason? Okay? So let's watch. At school, What's the matter? It's Greg. He hurt his back. Poor Greg. Later. Hi, Greg. How are you? I'm better, thanks. What happened? I was walking home yesterday. Suddenly, I heard a noise. There was a kitten in the street. Then I saw a boy. He was riding his bike. But he didn't see the kitten. Oh no! Was he going fast? Did he hit it? No, he didn't. I ran to help it, but I slipped and hurt my back. Oh, Greg. But the kitten is okay. Next day at school... Look! Greg saved a kitten. A reporter took a photo and wrote an article about it. Hi guys, why are you reading that article? Because it's about you, Greg. You're a hero. You see? Yeah, let's watch one more time, my friends. Pay attention, what happened with Greg? He slipped, he broke, he fell down, he hurt, he hit, he sprained it, no? What's the matter with Greg? One more time, okay? Let's watch. At school. Hi, Faye. What's the matter? It's Greg. He hurt his back. Poor Greg. Later. Hi, Greg. How are you? I'm better, thanks. What happened? I was walking home yesterday. Suddenly, I heard a noise. There was a kitten in the street. Then I saw a boy. He was riding his bike, 
but he didn't see the kitten. Oh no! Was he going fast? Did he hit it? No, he didn't. I ran to help it, but I slipped and hurt my back. Oh, Greg. But the kitten is okay. Next day at school. Look! Greg saved a kitten. A reporter took a photo and wrote an article about it. Hi, guys. Why are you reading that article? Because it's about you, Greg. You're a hero. Okay, volunteers, look at the book. What's the matter with Greg? Who can tell me? What is the problem with Greg? What's the matter? Okay, Leonardo, tell me. What's the matter with Greg? He hurt his back. Oh, good. That is the reason, no? He hurt his back. Other oh, student, please. Why? Who can tell me the reason? Why Greg hurt? He's back. Fernanda, tell me, please. Because he saved the kitten. Yeah, that's right. Because he saved a kitten. Yes, no? And how it goes? Well, yesterday, no, yesterday, as says Greg, he was, who can tell me? He was cleaning the car. Teacher. He was looking he at the was Tell me, Fabrice. Welcome. Yeah, he was walking, no? He was walking home. Very good. And then he saw an animal in the street. What animal? Not a cat. Cat, no teacher. But it's not a cat, it's a baby cat. Kitten. It's a kitty. Yeah, a kitty, a kitten, a baby cat. And also Greg saw a boy. No, there was another boy there. What was doing this other boy? He was watering the plants? He was riding, riding a bike. Yeah, that is. He was riding his bike. So Greg ran to save the kitten and then he fell down and hurt his back. That is the reason, no? That says. And Fernanda is right. Greg hurt his back because he saved a kitten good and now if you look at here appear the photo of greg in the newspaper no appear maybe there was a reporter there and they took the photo okay now my friends is your turn please read one more time the story i am going to give you six minutes answer these questions okay answer these questions what's the matter with greg what was greg doing before the accident before means remember for example now is nine o'clock before is eight o'clock seven o'clock six o'clock that is before what did greg see in the street what was the other boy doing did greg help the kitten yes or no and why there was a photo of greg in the newspaper what is the reason please you have six minutes complete oh come on complete please your book try to make sentences okay write complete ideas let's work please let's work let's work you have six minutes Fabricio, read your book. Let's complete, okay? Let's answer this question. Teacher, um, disculpe, mi internet estuvo mal. ¿Me puede volver a repetir, por favor? Ah, Fabricio, you are going to read the story and answer these questions. You have six minutes. Okay, teacher.
Complete, please, your books. Complete, look. That's fine, no? Question. What's the matter with Greg? What was Greg doing? Can I participate? Yes, Valentino. But, Valentino, if you finish the one, yeah, you are going to help me in the one. But continue, please. Complete the number two in your book. Complete the number three in your book. Complete the number four. Complete the number five. Complete the number six. Okay? All. See, do you remember this action? No, see, look, watch. What did Greg see? Look in the street. What was the other boy doing? We practice these questions, no? What was Karen doing yesterday? What was Anthony doing? What was Carl doing? What were you doing yesterday morning? What were you doing yesterday afternoon? This is the same, the same question. Did Greg have the kitten? You have two options, yes or no. No, but complete, a complete idea. And the last is why. And in why we use because, okay? With a question with why, we use because, and then you give a reason. I'm going to choose some students, okay? Yeah, okay, Leonardo, please you help me. Number two. Chiara, please, the number three. Oh, Luciana Canes, Luciana. The number four, you help me. Number five, let's see. So yet you the number five. Um, yeah, one more time, Abril, Palomino. If you finish, you can also participate. Only raise your hand, okay? Maybe there is a possibility that Leonardo or Chiara or Luciana or Sayed or Abril can answer the question. So you participate, okay? But you need to finish all. Finish the one, finish the two, finish the three, the four, the five, and the six. Yeah, three, two minutes more to finish. Come on, complete your books. When you answer, make sense. Okay, try to make sentence. Okay. Valentina, you finished the one, no? Can you read, please, the question and the answer? Okay. What's the matter with Greg? He hurt his back. Good job, boy. Yes, that is, no? What's the matter? What's the problem with Greg? What happened with Greg? He hurt his back. Okay? Thank you. Leonardo, did you finish? Yes. Read, please. Question and answer. What was Greg doing before the accident? He was working home. Very good. Thank you, Leonardo. No? Boys, remember, the question is with was. We answer with was. No? This is doing. So, walking. You see? Thank you, Leonardo. Chiara, See young teacher. Chiara, please, number three. The question, the question and the answer. Chiara, read. 
Yeah, more time, okay? Sayet, number five, please. Did Greg help the kid ten? Greg, yes, I help the kitten. Yes, he, no, because the question is about Greg, okay? Yes, he helped the kitten. He did. He helped. Yeah, it's good. Thank you, Isajet. You're right. Chera, did you finish the number three? What did Greg see in the street? This is in past tense, so you need to answer in past, the past of see in a sentence. Chera, no, you didn't complete. Other student, please raise your hand for the number three. What did Greg see in the street? Fernanda, please tell me. He saw the kitten. Yeah, very good. He saw a kitten because the question is in past, in past tense. So we answer in past. Luciana, number four, please. Luciana. Yeah. Was what was the other boy doing? Yeah, tell me. He was cleaning the car. He was watering the plants. He was looking at the stars. What was the other boy? In the story appeared another he boy. He was looking in the plant. Mm, you need to read a story, Luciana. Read. It's there, the yeah. mention there. Other student, please raise your hand. So please tell me number four. Yes, that is. Luciana, pay more attention. The other boy was riding bike. Okay. And to finish, Abril, please. Why was there a photo of Greg in the newspaper? Why? Professor, because I saved a kite. A kitten and yeah. he's a hero. And he's a hero, no? That's right. But we are going to use the past tense, okay, Abril? The past tense. He saved the kitten, yes, and he was a hero. Yeah, but you have the idea. It's good, Abril. Good job. Because he saved the kitten. This is one reason. No, and the reporter took a photo because for him it was good news and the other option is this not because he was a hero okay only check please check thank you valentino thank you leonardo finish please thank you fernanda so uh, thank you sayet and abril complete please complete now let's continue talking about accidents, okay? Incidents. What's the matter? What's the problem? Finish, please. Finish. One moment. Okay, yeah, one moment I'm going to give you. Complete check, huh? Check. Oh, I did this good. No, I complete. Also this, also this I complete. No, I fail in this part. Okay, check. Check your answers. Rihanna, did you finish? No, no so not yet, Sebastian. Okay, continue, please. Nadine, did you finish? Camila, did you finish? Yes, teacher. Thank you, Gear. Maria yes, teacher. Thank you. Maria Gracia, did you finish? Yes, 
Ricardo, did you finish, boy? Yeah. Yes, teacher. Okay, let's go to the next activity, okay? The audio. We have an audio. And then we play a game, okay? After the audio. Let's see. Let's go to the audio, the listening. Activity number four. Boys, you are going to listen the same, a similar story. And then you are going to check only in the pictures that are correct. Only in the pictures that happen in the story. If in the story says that the boy have breakfast, or in the past, no, had breakfast, you check. But in the story, didn't mention this part, only in blank. Okay? Yeah, let's listen. Four. Listen and tick the correct pictures. Hello? Hi, Trevor. What's the matter? Why didn't you call? Hi, Fred. Today was the worst day of my life. Why? Because everything went wrong. What happened? Well, first I woke up late and I didn't have time to have breakfast. Then I went to the bus stop and waited for the bus, but it never came. So I went back home and I got my bike and I had an accident. An accident? Were you going fast? Yes, I was. That was the problem. Suddenly, I slipped on some water and I fell off my bike. I was wet, dirty, and my arm really hurt. Oh, Trevor, did you see a doctor? Is your arm okay now? No, it isn't. I went to the hospital. You see, I broke it. Oh, no. It really was a bad day. Yeah, one repetition more. Listen. Four. Listen and tick the correct pictures. Hello? Hi, Trevor. What's the matter? Why didn't you call? Hi, Fred. Today was the worst day of my life. Why? Because everything went wrong. What happened? Well, first I woke up late and I didn't have time to have breakfast. Then I went to the bus stop and waited for the bus, but it never came. So I went back home and I got my bike and I had an accident. An accident? Were you going fast? Yes, I was. That was the problem. Suddenly, I slipped on some water and I fell off my bike. I was wet, dirty, and my arm really hurt. Oh, Trevor. Did you see a doctor? Is your arm okay now? No, it isn't. I went to the hospital. You see, I broke it. Oh, no. It really was a bad day. Okay, my friends. Boys, one volunteer, who can tell me what happened in the story, in the audio? What picture is true? Okay, so tell me, please. One picture is, is correct. Yeah, but describe the picture, please. What happened? Uh... Ah, he didn't have breakfast. This picture, the B? The A. Oh, the A. Yes, this is correct. He woke up. That is okay in past tense. He woke up late. Okay. Okay, he woke up late. Thank you. Another student, please. What happened also in the story? He had breakfast. He was waiting for the bus. He was going in the bus. He had an accident. He went to the hospital. What happened in the audio? Other student, Fabricio, tell me, please. He had an accident. Yes, they mentioned, no? 
but he has an accident. Good. Another student, please. Other volunteer, raise your hand. What other picture is correct? I am teacher. Hey, tell me, say it. La F. Yeah, but what happened here, Sayet? He? Accident. Yeah, but repeat please, Sayet. He went to the hospital. He went to the hospital. Yes, not because the accident, he went to the hospital. Thank you. Another student? What else happened in the story? This, this, or this? Yeah, the last is the letter C, okay? He was waiting for the bus. But the bus never came, says. So he decided to return home, to home, return home and took the bicycle. He was going fast and in that part there was a there was water on the street, so he fell down with a bike, you know? That says. Okay, yeah, let's make a stop here, okay? Because it's bad for us to be sitting all the time. Stand up, please, my friends. We are going to move a little, okay? Stand up. We are going to move a little with this song. Healthy music for a child's heart. Stand up in your place, my friends. Lucia, move. Stand up, please, Lucia. Manuel, stand up. Move and freeze from the award-winning CD. Let's move a little, okay? Let's move a little, okay? Stand up, move your hands. Christopher, come on, Christopher. Come on, move. When you say move, and freeze. When you listen, move, move is move, no? You move. When you listen, freeze, you, means a stop. Okay? Yeah, let's continue. Come on, move. Move your hands. And freeze. And freeze. Come on, move. move your hands, Sebastian. And move your hands. Come on, move. move your hands. And freeze. Put your right hand on your left knee. Your left now hand your hands right. on your left. Your knees move in and out. Okay, in your left. Your hands stay tight. Now keep on with your moving. Then Put you switch your hands, your okay? Knees. Your hands. Keep on moving in and out till we say freeze. Come on. Move your hands and freeze and stop there. Come on, move. Move and, and freeze. freeze. Come on, move and freeze. freeze. Come on, one move. more time. Move and, and freeze. freeze. Put one hand across your shoulder, shoulder in the shoulder and the other in the back. Now jump okay. In place. And you're going like to move like that. that. Yeah. Yeah. Switch, and cross your switch your hands like this. Switch. Your switch. Back. Yes. Now just be nimble, just be quick. Just Leonardo, like switch yeah. your hands. Come on. Come on. Jump. Move your hands like this. And freeze. Freeze. Come on. Jump. Luciana Canes, move your hands. And freeze. Come on. Jump. And freeze. Come on. Jump. And freeze. Okay. Yeah, let's just stop here, okay? Stand up, please. Uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Sit down, please. Sit down. We are going to continue. Other days we continue with the song, okay? Please, we are going to play now a game. But for this game, you need to remember the vocabulary. This vocabulary. Okay? Open, please, your microphones. Repeat. Sleep. 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 Spray. 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 Okay, my friends, please, in your computers, open one Kahoot, okay? We are going to play. You are going to answer the question, what's the matter? You are going to look at the picture. And if the picture says, what's the matter? And maybe he sleep it, you check sleep it, okay? 
Dalping is in the chat. Also, the link is in the chat. Please enter, okay? The question says, was the mother? You look at the picture, and if the picture says he broke his arm or his leg, you check that, broke. If maybe it's not broke, maybe it's hit. No, hit is this. Or maybe not hit, maybe it's a sprain. Okay, and then we practice in groups, okay, the conversation. Yeah, let's go, enter, please, enter. Come on, we are 26 in this class. Good, it's Luciana, Vanessa, Valentina, Jose, Massimo, Chiara, Alexia, Angelina, Camila, Christopher, Leonardo, Zoe. Valentino, Jan, say, enter, please. Rafaela, enter, please. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Valentino Jansen. Christopher. Oh, Christopher is here. Maria Gracia, please enter. Rihanna, okay, good. Sajet, Alexia is here. Leonardo. Camila Paredes is here. Vanessa, hurry up. Enter. Teacher, espera un momentito, please. Hurry up, boy. You need to pay attention more. Angelina. Es que teacher. Angelina. Ah, Angelina is here. Let's see. Teacher, wait a minute. I will enter. Good, Maria Gracia, Manuel, Sebastián. Okay, we are 25. Let's start, okay? Fernanda, Fernanda Condor. She's Fernanda. Yeah, it's okay, Valentina. Yeah, let's answer, okay? Look at the picture uh, and tell me. If you had problems in the chat, use the chat. One. What's the mother? What's the matter with the man? Boys, remember, this is in your vocabulary. My back hurts. Back. Not just the uncle. It's not a sprain. Look at your book. Look at your vocabulary. Second, what's the matter? Broke my leg. That is broke, no? The past tense of break. Good, Sebastian. Number three. What's the matter? Yesterday I was running and I. I fell my ankle. Caí mi, mi tobillo. I sprained my ankle. Okay? Me doble el tobillo. Me torcí. It's not fell. Try to read a sentence, the complete sentence. What's the matter? My heart, I hurt my arm because yesterday I. of my bike that is the correct no a motorbike it's a bike 
I lost. Okay, this is the pass of lose. Perdi. Okay, that is sixth. Why are you hungry? Because I had breakfast. I hit breakfast. I didn't have breakfast. I broke breakfast. Yeah, I didn't have, okay? That is, I didn't have my breakfast. Seven, I am tired because I... I went to bed late. Now that is the bet. That's why I am tired because the bet. Eight. Yesterday at school, Tom. What action is that? Hit, yes, that is hit, okay? Golpear, hit. And the last, oh, not the last, nine. He, when he was playing basketball, he. Sleep it. That is. And to finish the thing, okay? Why are you sad? lost my dog no that is okay okay let's see the results leonardo good job third place rihanna very good gear second place for you and the number one is valentino congratulations valentino sebastian number four good job and alexia safora good job gear continue like that okay my friends now we are going to make groups to practice the poem okay not a poem, sorry, sorry, sorry. This conversation. Pay attention, huh? this is the example. Pay attention. Valentino, please give me the question for the teacher. Valentino, you this question and this question, okay? What's the matter? My back hurts. Why? Because I fell off my bike. Okay? No fall, huh? no fall. We use the pass. Fell. I fell off my bike. Okay? Christopher, please tell me the questions. What's the matter? I am hungry. We? Oui? Because I didn't have breakfast. This is in present. Oh, come on. Present, no. Past tense, okay? This, no. I need to use didn't have breakfast. No, fall, fell. Okay? Rihanna, please give me the question. Rihanna, give me the questions, please. What? 
I am tired. Why? Because I went. Oh, because I went to bed late. No, I just sleep late. Okay, it's different, huh? Yeah, let's continue. Leonardo, please give me the question. You watch the mother. I am sad. Why? Oh, because I lost. Because I lost my favorite book. Okay. And to finish, Massimo, please tell me the questions. What's the matter? I can walk. Why? Because I sprain it. Oh, I sprain it my ankle. Okay, my friends, you are going to practice this conversation. But remember, pay attention here. If you says my back hurts, it's because this reason. If you says I am hungry because I didn't have breakfast. If you says I am tired because I went to bed late. If you says I am sad because I lost my favorite book. And if you say I can't walk because I sprained my ankle. It's red with red. Pink with pink, purple with purple, green with green. It's not possible to say, what's the matter? I am hungry. Why? Because I lost my favorite book. Hmm? This is strange. Not sense. It doesn't have sense. No tiene sentido si dices tengo hambre. ¿Por qué? Porque perdí mi libro. You see? Well, it's not good, no? Because I didn't have breakfast. That is the correct reason. Okay? Please copy this in your book or take a picture of this, okay? Make a screenshot or copy in your books, okay? To practice the conversation. Are you ready? The color soil. The colors, red, green with green, red with red, pink with pink. Also the sentences, I fell, I lost, I went, I didn't have. And remember, you answer why with because. Always is with because. Are you ready? Yes? Yes, are you ready? Yeah, we are going to make groups now, okay? 15 minutes you have to practice this. We are 20. Yeah, groups of three students, okay? Yeah, are you ready? Yes? Paolo, are you ready? Yes. Okay, let's make groups. Accept the invitation, please go to your groups. Let's go. Dana, accept the invitation, let's go. Leonardo, please, the question for Rihanna. Okay. What's the matter? Ha 
hilang beli. Why? Because I mm, I didn't have breakfast. Yeah, good. Rihanna, question for Leonardo. What's the matter? My I'm hung. I'm sad. Why? I uh, because I lost my favorite book. That's good, Leonardo. Please, Leonardo, question for Camila. What's the matter, Camila? I'm sad. Why? I lost my favorite book. Camila, question for Rihanna, please. What's the matter, Rihanna? I'm tired. Why? I'm when because I when I lost my favorite doll. Yeah, it's good. Good, my friends. You can change. Teacher, is possible says other things. Yes, you can says I lost my cat. I am sad because I lost my cat. I am sad because my dog died. No, I can walk because I sprained my ankle. I can walk because I broke my leg. No, you can say that. Oh, what's the matter? I can write. It's not possible to write, teacher, because I broke my arm. Okay, it's possible to change, but continue practice. Okay, it's good. Continue, please, practicing. Manuel, please, question for Paolo. Yo voy a hacer el primero, este. Ajá. What's the major? My... I'm hungry. Why? I didn't have breakfast. Breakfast. Yeah, good. Paolo, question for Manuel. Yeah. What the mother? I broke hers. What? I I didn't have breakfast. Yeah, stop, Manuel. Si vas a decir back hers, tiene que ser con el yellow. Si vas a decir el yellow de aquí arriba, el amarillo, tienes que decir con el amarillo. No puedo decir, ¿qué pasó? Mi espalda me duele. El amarillo es eso, mi espalda me duele. ¿Por qué? Porque no tomé desayuno. ¿Tiene sentido? Ah, oh, no, no, no. No puedes decir cualquier palabra. Tiene que ser la razón correcta. ¿Ok? Paolo, one more time, please. The question for Manuel. What, my mother? My back hurts. We, oui. the why? Uh, uh, I feel of bike. Okay, Dana, question please for Manuel. Carrion, question for Manuel, please. What's the mother? My back hurts. Manuel, utiliza uno de estos, distinto, ya no lo mismo de acá. I am hungry. Why? I didn't have breakfast. Good. Manuel, please, question for Dana. 
What the mother? I can't watch. Why? Dana, why? Are you spraying it? Dana, repeat. Because. Because I sprain it my ankle. Because, because I sprain it my, my ankle. Yes, that is. Paolo, please. Question for Dana. What's the mother? I can't walk. Okay, Dana, pero ot otra ya. Es lo mismo que dijiste con Manuel. Con Manuel dijiste, I can walk. Cambiamos, distinto. I am sad, I am tired, I am hungry. Ok, different. Repeat, please, Paolo, your question. I am sad. Why? Because I went to be light. Dana, repeat, because... Because I lost my favorite book. I lost my favorite book. A ver, de nuevo, en castellano. Chicos, si vas a decir el rojo, tienes que usar el rojo aquí. No puedes dar otra oración, no tendría sentido. Si vas a decir I am sad, que es el morado, tienes que decir el otro, el morado. Si vas a decir el que es amarillo, el yellow, tienes que decir el yellow. No puedes decir otro color porque no va a tener sentido si no. ¿Ok? Continue practicing, please. Continue, ¿ok? Continue practicing. Boys, let's practice. Angelina, please. Question for Sebastián. What's the matter? No la escuché. Angelina, repeat your question, please. What's the matter? My back tired. Why? Because of my bike yesterday morning. Yeah, thank you, Angelina. Vanessa, question for Sebastian, please. What's the matter? Mm, my, my back. Stop, Sebastian. Sebastian, no hay que decir lo mismo de acá. Usa lo que tienes aquí. Escoge uno y das la razón. ¿Ok? Yeah, Sebastian, uh, sorry, Vanessa, the question please for Sebastian. What's the matter? What answer my answer? Why? My white answer. Sebastián, si ya dijiste sad, Vanessa te está diciendo por qué, why. Tienes que usar uno de estos de aquí. El que corresponde a sad es el morado. Tienes que decir because I lost my favorite book. Repeat, Sebastián. Because, because I, lost I lost my favorite book. My favorite book. Good. Okay, that is purple with purple, red with red. Okay, Sebastian, please. Question for Angelina. What's the mother? I am hungry. 
while I didn't have breakfast. Very good, Angelina. Sebastián, question for Maria Gracia. What's the mother? Why does it Why? Good, thank you. Vanessa, question for Maria Gracia, please. One more time. What the mother? My dad's Ah, Maria Gracia, ya no lo mismo de acá. Tienes que cambiar. No voy a decir siempre my back hearts, my back hearts. Utilice lo que tienes aquí. I am hungry, I am tired, I am sad, I can walk. Okay? Repeat, please, Vanessa, your question. What's the mother? I am hungry. Why? Maria Gracia, repeat. Because. Because. I didn't have breakfast. Maria. Repeat. Because I didn't have breakfast. Because, Maria, repeat, because, I didn't have breakfast. No, check your microphone, okay, Maria, it's not working. Okay, let's return. And I suppose, welcome back. I suppose you practice with your group. I was checking some students. Ricardo, what's the matter, Ricardo? I am green. Why? I haven't breakfast. I didn't have breakfast, I remember. I didn't have breakfast. Remember, my friends, it's in past tense, huh? no in present. It's in past. Okay? okay. Waman, Sayet. Waman, Sayet. What's the matter? Teacher? What's the mother? My back hurts. Yeah, okay. But, chicos, utilicen lo que no está en la conversación, ya? Otro, lo que está al costado. Lo que tienen al costado. What's the mother, Sayet? I am angry. Why? Uh, If you say hungry, it's because I didn't, I didn't have, breakfast. have breakfast. Por eso les dije, copy en esto. Copy this in your book. Copy. Red with red, green with green, pink with pink. Okay, my friends, we are going to stop here. Pay attention now. Oh, it is not this. Chicos. En estos cuatro minutos que nos queda, quiero que me prestes atención, ¿ya? El día martes es feriado, así que no vamos a tener clases, pero el día miércoles, solo a nosotros, quinto B, les voy a explicar ya de antemano porque vamos a tener la evaluación de Anglia. El año pasado ustedes ya han tomado la evaluación de Anglia a mediados de año, casi por, este, por estas fechas, y lo mismo vamos a hacer. Está programado para que se realice la evaluación de Anglia. Va a ser el día miércoles. Pero como el martes no nos vamos a ver y el miércoles solo tenemos 40 minutos, estoy haciendo la socialización. Recuérdense que... La... Sí. Mi internet se fue, no sé qué están haciendo. ¿Me podría okay, pero decir? una pregunta. ¿El miércoles no era feriado? El martes es el feriado, Fernando. El martes, no el miércoles. El miércoles tenemos una hora, 40 minutos. En ese tiempo se va a tomar la evaluación de Anglia. 
a inicios de año ya la tomaste conmigo. ¿Se acuerdan? Yo te envié un link. Tú completaste tus nombres, pusiste el co tu correo, un correo que yo te envié. Pero esta vez va a ser distinto. Por eso te, quiero que me prestes atención. Yo te voy a enviar el link, como siempre. Pero si tú te fijas en el link, aparece directamente ya las preguntas. Teacher, y nuestros nombres han cambiado la plataforma y solo vas a completar tus nombres cuando tú culmines la evaluación. ¿Ok? Te recuerdo que son 100 preguntas, pero no todos llegamos a las 100 preguntas. Algunos llegamos a 50, otros a 60, otros a 70. Cuando tu evaluación se corte, te va a aparecer... Te va a pedir tus datos, te va a pedir tu nombre, tu first name, tu last name. Ahí vas a poner tu nombre, tu apellido. Vas a poner también el código del colegio. ¿Ya? Esta vez es al final, no es al inicio. Quiero que entiendan eso bien. Si, tú, si, yo, te, si yo te envío el link, es directo la evaluación. Tu nombre lo completas cuando finalice tu evaluación. Si llegó al 50 y te cortó ahí, ahí te va a salir una ventana, te va a pedir tus datos, entonces tú completas con tus datos. ¿Ok? Y después te va a dar también tu resultado. Escúcheme bien, el resultado de todo esto va a llegar de acá a dos, tres meses todavía. Tú vas a estar diciéndome, teacher... ¿Qué no te he sacado? ¿Qué no te he sacado? ¿Hasta cuánto tengo? ¿Qué nivel me ha calificado? Para no esperar todos esos tres meses, cuando tú termines tu evaluación, ahí te dice qué nivel has logrado. Te dice, después de que coloques tu nombre, te dice ahí. Claro, todo está en inglés, ¿no? Yo te sugiero que le hagas una captura de pantalla y así ya sabes en qué nivel estás. ¿Ok? A ver, preguntas. Zoe, ¿tienes una pregunta? Sí, profesor. Eh, el día martes, que es feriado, no vamos a tener clases. Entonces, ¿el día miércoles vamos a realizar esto? Claro, eso es lo que he dicho. El miércoles. El miércoles ya no te voy a explicar otra vez todo esto. Por eso te estoy explicando ahora. El miércoles, ah, mi bien, sí. ingreso, te envío tu link y empiezas a hacer tu evaluación. ¿Ok? ¿Alguna otra pregunta? Muy bien, chicos. Tú ya conoces la evaluación. Hemos estado dando con quiz, ¿no? Algunas partes, algunas secciones. Es la misma modalidad. Solo que ha cambiado, como te vuelvo a repetir, la, eh, dónde pones tu nombre. Ya no se pone al inicio, sino es cuando finaliza tu evaluación, cuando, cuando le, la evaluación te corta. ¿Ok? En ese momento vas a colocar tus nombres, tus apellidos y el código del colegio. Si te olvidas de colocar el código, ya sabes que no va a llegar tu resultado. Okay, no se 